somebody left this on my chair. It's clever, because it forces me to either deal with the file or never sit down again. Cindy Kramer, I told her you'd see her. You shouldn't have told her that. She's got metastatic squamous cell lung cancer, six months tops. Have you even looked at the x-ray? No, I'm just guessing. It's a new game. If I'm wrong, she wins a stuffed bear. A spot on an x-ray doesn't necessarily mean that she's terminal. I love children. So filled with hope. It could be pneumonia. It could be sarcoidosis. Could be. She didn't already have swollen hyalur lymph nodes on the other lung. Could we at least brainstorm for other ideas? Thank you. I still think pneumonia and sarcoidosis, but. We should check for tuberculosis and definitely rule out congestive heart failure. Five stages of dying. Exactly. Personally, I think it's all just new age crap, but from your tear-filled puppy dog eyes, I think I made my point. Now go tell Cindy, whatever her name is, that she's dying. Oh no, now you've left your entire body in my chair. What does that mean you want? I need a segmental bronchoalveolar lavage. I take it the CT with contrast came back? They're not definitive. Biopsy would be. Biopsy would be invasive and unnecessary. And definitive. But you don't want definitive. You want to hang on to your delusions as long as you can. A lavage could prove it's not cancer. But you need me to approve the procedure. It must be a bitch. The answer is no. Why? Because it's me? I'm over you. I've jumped on the bandwagon. I hate you, okay? Great. Let's treat her. What is it? You won't help Cindy, but you're obsessed with this piece of dirt. Are you just trying to prove that who someone is doesn't matter? That all that matters is your stupid puzzle? Fine. Treat them the same. That's all I'm asking. One test. Wow. That is remarkable. According to those patchouli oil selling new agers. It's supposed to be the terminal patient, but you're going through the five stages. You just made a completely seamless transition from anger to bargaining. Cover two more of my clinic hours, and you can have your one procedure. Cindy's divorced. She doesn't have any kids, no siblings, both her parents are It's going... not your job to be her friend. Do you understand? And it's not worth it. She feels better her final few days, and you're not the same. Maybe for years. You don't think it's worth it? I know it's not worth it. My husband it would... I met him just after he was diagnosed with terminal brain cancer. If I hadn't married him, he was alone. When a good person dies, there should be an impact on the world. Somebody should notice. Somebody should be upset. Just a cough. And the major lift, the baffled king composing hallelujah. Hallelujah. And she tied you to her kitchen chair. And she broke your throne and she cut your hair. And from your lips, she drew.